Hey, so I'm back on. Uh, just a few minutes ago, I was just wearing the motorcycle jacket and I was dig doing a reply episode to the dude that asked me a question about have I ever dealt with addictions or whatever, right? Played an episode or whatever if this is uploaded separately. I don't know. Fuck. The jacket was getting hot and I got work to do at the shop here still. So anyway, uh, I wanted to talk about the addiction thing, man. One of the ways that I deal or that I have dealt and currently deal with uh, any kind of like time I want to just chill out and relax and, you know, soothe whatever minor anxiety I might have. I tend to watch YouTube videos of, uh, as I've uploaded today, uh, girls running track, contortionist girls, yoga girls, and uh, pretty much any kind of uh, girl, sporting, girl sports, women's volleyball, shit like that. It's just relaxing for me to watch female form in motion, so to speak, right? So that's one of my ways that I handle things. How, how do I handle addiction? Well, that's one answer, man. The other answer actually is anime. Yeah, I'm an anime nerd, even though I'm 42 years old or whatever, right? I'm always looking for something obscure to watch, too. So this was some good shit. I want to, you know what I'm saying? Uh, I'll show you guys here. I just spent over 100 bucks on uh, these books. It's a series called Bakuan, if I'm saying it correctly. Bakuan or Bakuan? Okay, it's a Japanese, uh, this shit here, I shouldn't say this shit, it's a very well drawn and well, well thought out, like, anime for adults. It's, it's about, picture the Power Rangers or any other Sailor Moon combination of high school girls that ride motorcycles in Japan. Okay, that's what this anime is about. This is in, I don't read Japanese or kanji or whatever, but the book's all black and white comics about... Uh, it's about these girls that uh, pretty much started a motorcycle club in their high school. And it's a, dr it's a little drama. There's an animated series. And I wanted to support the creator. Hint, hint, wink, wink. For instance, if you guys like this channel with me on it, then I think it's a good idea that you go and purchase some of my products and movies or whatever to further support the creator behind shit. I always buy extra shit. Like, if I watch this anime or cartoon and I like it, I'll pay the money and I'll go buy all their books or whatever, hard copies and shit. Not only so that I have it, but just so that I could support the original artist and creator for the work and time that they put into drawing the shit and making it or whatever. You know, it's a lot of work to make stuff. People don't realize, man. All of these movies you guys see, cartoons, YouTube channels, this shit you're watching right now, what takes other humans time, man? Fuck. So the very least you could do, the very least you could do if you like somebody's shit is at least purchase something from them directly or whatever. You know, before you go off the wall, leaving all kind of comments and shit, man, do a little bit of shopping in the goddamn store. Support the people. You know what I'm saying? If you like an anime or some shit, buy the fucking books. Buy the hard copy. For real. The fuck? I mean, I, under, I understand, okay, it, you know, motherfuckers like torrents. I like torrents and shit too sometimes. But if I like the shit, I'm still gonna go buy the real shit. You got me? I got a bootleg Adidas tracksuit and I got a real Adidas tracksuit. Because I like the bootleg one so much, I said, you know what, I'm gonna go buy the real one. Okay? That's what you do. You support the original creator of shit if you find out that you're into it. That way it enables the people to go and make more shit so that they're not starving. You know what I'm saying? It takes a lot of work, especially for a nigga like me. God damn, do you realize that I came from Oakland, California? It should be a fucking miracle. A fucking miracle that I'm a movie producer, actor, this, that, all on my own accord and own merits. Huh? I come from the land and city of drive-by shootings and crack rock slangers and shit like that. Yet I still have enough of a creative mind to make a goddamn YouTube channel, X video channel, this website, that website. All this series shit is from my brain, my imagination. My creativity wasn't stunted and stifled. Or rolled the fuck over and flattened by the American educational system. You know what I'm saying? Though they try to crush your dreams very much. I think it's one of their goals, you know? Crush that independent thought so you're dependent on them and shit, right? Man, oh man. 
fuck. So yeah, man. Reward creative minds when you're able to. If you like cartoons, like for instance, I, I happen to like the Boondocks, right? Even before the shit was even on TV, I was buying all their comic books. The hard copies and this and that. And I was supporting them posting their comics and other, you know, doing what I can, whatever. But I'm still supporting them at a grassroots level. So just take that into consideration. So anyway, yeah, um, about, about, this is like a really fucking awesome anime book. About five high school girls that uh, pretty much start up a bike club. And as usual, the formula, you know, there's, there's like a young one, a rich one, an older one, a MILF one, the, the mystery one that doesn't wear the, ever take the helmet off, shit like that. The blonde one, the Sailor Moon one, etc. You know? Virtual surrogate girlfriends if you're a lonely guy. Hey, here's what it is, man. So yeah, with a combination of anime girls, uh, YouTube fitness models who I sometimes interact with and shit like that, and just follow along workouts, etc. That's how I handle my addictions, anxiety, etc. to answer the dude's question or whatever. So yeah, you can have healthy addictions, you can have healthy hobbies and pastimes. And you can also have unhealthy ones or whatever. But uh, you, got, you guys might notice that I don't, I don't actually take, even though I push a lot of shit to the limit, I don't take anything to the extreme. I don't overindulge in anything that usurps a whole fuck ton lot of my time, right? Running is the most important addiction that I have. It's one of the first things I do every day for like, it's going to be for life. It's what I do, right? So... You know, that comes first, but I don't, I still don't let it consume half of my day. It's that important to me that I do it as soon as I get up or whatever, and I feel better as a result. So I do it, but in limited doses. I, th I think the key word here is limited doses. I, I don't watch anime all day. I watch like one or two episodes and I'm good. I don't smoke weed all day. I might smoke one or two joints and I'm good for a while, unless some shit comes up, etc. You know what I'm saying? I don't do this fucking show all goddamn day or even every day. I don't shoot porn every day. I don't even fuck every day. I don't have a massage every day, though that would be nice and I'm not in Thailand at the moment, etc. But I mean, you know, I do think a lot of times when people uh, deprive themselves of what makes them feel good, they tend to binge a lot. And uh, I don't necessarily have to binge too often because I'm pretty much... You know, pretty much happy, satisfied, pretty much across the board or whatever. But, you know, there are times where I can binge or whatever. I'm aware of that. You know what I'm saying? It's, it's important that you be aware of what you're doing. There's a lot of addicts in the world that actually are not aware of uh, what they're doing and what impact that all their behaviors have on the entire world around them, really. So, it is what it is, man. But yeah, hey, man, this, this anime, Bakuan, good shit, if I'm saying it correctly. Good shit. Mm -hmm. Especially if you're into if you're into motorcycles or racing, especially it's uh, you'll like it. Okay, so it's it's got the two thumbs up, shimmy approved or whatever. Check that shit out or whatever. Um, I actually was able to watch it on the site called Nine Anime or Anime Nine or something. Just Google it and look for the show or whatever. And do like I say, if you like if you like the folks. Buy that shit. It's only available in Japan on like eBay Japan or .co.jp or something. But uh, look their shit up. It might be on Amazon Japan as well too, if you want the the book series or whatever. All right. So that's that's that, folks. All right. Thank you for watching. And if you guys have any more questions, hit me up below. I'll try to get back to you when I can. All right. I'm Shimmy Cash. Google me. Look me up. If you want to support me, do so by buying my movies. I want your money, honey. All right. I'm out of here. Ciao. Thank you. Have a good day.